I wanted to talk about an application of parabolas. Parabolas are actually an, a par, part of our everyday life and we don't even know it. Consider, I'm going to consider a couple of examples. Think of a satellite dish. Yeah, some people get TV that way. They have the shape and up here there's this arm. The shape of the satellite dish is a parabola. In three dimensions, all right, it's, it's, it's a dish, not just a line, but it's a dish. But that shape is a parabola. Now, the nature of a parabola is the following. Whenever a, a radio wave comes down from outer space, no matter where it hits the satellite dish, they all get reflected to that point right there. Doesn't matter where it hits it, that's what happens. They all get focused to that point right there. That is the focus that we learned, or we found earlier when we solved problems with parabolas. That's why being able to find the focus is really important. But what happens is the radio waves come down, they all get focused to this right here, and then they go down the wire and to your TV and you get to be able to see TV, watch TV. Now let's think of this backwards. Let's say we got a parabola this way. If you look at the headlight of your car, the silver part on the inside, the lens, that shape is a parabola. Nowadays the engineering is pretty involved and a lot of times there's many, many parabolas within the lens, but they're usually the shape is a parabola. If this is the focus, that's where your light bulb will be. When you turn your light on, it doesn't matter where it strikes the shiny part of the lens. No matter where it strikes it, it's going to go straight out. And that's why you get to see at night when you drive down the road. It's because of parabolas. Yeah? So there's a, there's a lot of applications, a lot of very practical uses to parabolas. And those were a couple.